Hi, Valmont. Michael Austin here at Valmont Community Television. I'm joined today by Marion Farquharson, and we have an important announcement for anyone out there who is unemployed and not EI eligible. A new program being started in this area coming up very, very soon by the Ministry of Jobs, Innovation and Tourism. And we're joined today by Marion, who's going to be administering this program from the Valmont Learning Centre in Valmont. So Marion, welcome. Uh, this I? this project has come up very quickly. We've got a start date uh, of March the 14th, I believe. That's right. So just to give you a little bit of information on who's eligible, what the program involves, uh, and whatnot, we're just, we have Marion here today to, to sort of give us the rundown on um, how this whole program is going to work. So who is this program aimed at? Uh, it's, a, it's aimed at people who do not collect EI. They haven't collected EI in the last three years. Uh, if they have to be a citizen and they have to be or, or a landed immigrant and they have to be over 18 years of age which is a big widespread it could be a new immigrant it could be a housewife who wants to come back to work it could be somebody who just hasn't been working and hasn't got the hours in for EI it's quite a wide spectrum okay so now I believe that there's some uh, stipulations there about maternity leaves and such as there Oh yes, uh, they must not have collected maternity leave within the last five years, which would mean that their child should be coming up to school age. Okay. And can you tell us a little bit about the length of the program? It's 10 weeks. Uh, first six weeks are going to be in class. Okay. And the last four weeks of the course will be more in the training side towards getting looking towards getting a possible job. Okay, so six weeks classroom and then four weeks of kind of That's practical, right. Right. actually doing the job search. And uh, there is some training involved with this program as well. Can you give us an idea, a general idea about what the training would involve if you get into this program? The, the first part of the training is really, as the, if they're accepted on the course, they come for six weeks at a regular time. The course runs from nine until 3.30 approximately, every day from Monday to Friday. And part so of nine to three, so it's like a regular work day. Nine to three exactly, okay. exactly. And part of that is training because you have to get up in the morning, get dressed, get to the place that you've got to be, be there all day, have the rest of your life planned around this, which is all part of your working okay. life. And there's some courses also that, that will courses be included come, in this? Courses come later, a little bit later in the course. Uh, in order to prepare you to get into a job, most people need food safe, most people need... Uh, first aid training. Uh, it, there are different directions. If you want to go in a direction, you could be directed towards training in that area. That's all also paid for. Okay, great. Uh, now, I understand also that there's an allowance with this. You're actually going to pay me to come and take this course. Is that correct? Yes, because it's really important that you get back to work when you can get back to work. Okay. Uh, the training allowance is $50 a day, 250 a week, but it's $50 a day while you're in the course. And good. there's some other support systems for people in special situations or if you need particular uh, other supports of a particular nature? Yes, uh, there is help with transport, although I don't think that necessarily would involve Vailmount itself. It's more for the cities. Okay. But uh, there, are, there is some money for child caring and there's some money for working clothes and there also extraordinarily enough is a, a thing called an interview suit you get if you don't have any decent clothes to go for an interview really you get kitted out for that i'm gonna get a, a suit a tie you do and the works to do you it. do okay if you need it and <laughs> as well i understand that this isn't only for program participants there are some in incentives for employers as well and the incentives from employers just let me check and get this right because i'm I have to make sure I get the thing. We're a little new at this, so uh, it's coming uh, together employers fast. Employers should know that there's a possibility of getting a wage subsidy to hire one of our job option participants. Okay. Yes. So wage subsidy for employers. So if, if employers are interested, uh, they should contact you as well? Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. And I'm be at the Learning Centre. Okay. So service provider is the Valmont Learning Centre in beautiful downtown Valmont. That's uh, right. Corner of Fifth right. Avenue and... And? Across from the IGA. 
So that's that's where the training in this area is going to take place. And is, is this open to anyone in this area? How What are the boundaries uh, in no, terms of No, as far as I know, it's anybody who wants to employ from this area. So if you're from Tijon or Dunster or McBride Absolutely. and you're interested, Absolutely. give Marion a call at... There will be a course five zero. over to 560-4601. That's the Valemount Learning Center phone number. As well, there's a 1-800 number for... Uh, the ministry, and I don't know if we've got that here, but we're going to have a we quick look. Have, we should have, we should have. Uh, important date for this is March the 14th is when the actual selection process is going to take place. So you need to be in touch with Marion or the Ministry of before Jobs, Innovation and Tourism before the 14th to get your name on the list and get a, a slot so that, uh, so that you can actually... Uh, there are there are lim there are limited um, enrollment places, in this program, okay. and you will have to go through a selection process. Okay. The selection process will happen on the fourteenth of Very March, good. and the number to contact in Prince George is one eight six six four zero nine eight zero four four. And look out for the posters. There are some in the library. There's some in IGA. There's on television. Are we having it on the television screen? Uh, yes, we've got a uh, poster up on, or a uh, uh, bulletin up Just on the Just keep your eye open or come to the Learning Centre for sure and ask for me. I should be there. <laughs> <laughs> if she's not in the TV studio. I'm trying to promote the, the whole okay. programme, which I think is fabulous. I think it's a really worthwhile programme. So I think we've covered all the bases. So again, any questions, Marion's at the Valemont Learning Centre in Valemont. Area code 250-566-4601. Definitely call if you've got questions. Is there anything else that potential participants or employers need to know? Yeah, look forward to it. Okay. It should be fun. And the stress is off you because you're getting some cash in your hand at least. Mm, cash in which hand. Which is really important. Oh, I like that. And uh, not EI eligible? Gee, been there, done that. So it's nice to have these supports in place. Absolutely. Okay. And, you know, thanks to the ministry. Okay. Thanks for being here today. Thank you. Okay, Thank thanks. you. Look forward to meeting you.